Complete training is available at itdvds.com. Let's say you have a lot of windows open and you want to very quickly view the desktop. Well, you can with a new feature in Windows 7 called Peek. All you have to do is take your mouse and hover over the lower right hand corner of the taskbar and instantly you can see the desktop and any gadgets or icons on the desktop. If you want the applications to go back the way they were, you just take your mouse off of the lower right hand corner and all applications go back the way they were. If you wanted to minimize all of the applications, all you need to do is click on the lower right hand corner of the taskbar and all applications are minimized. Another great new feature is called Snap. With Snap, you can quickly view two windows at the same time, with one window taking up one half of the screen and the other window taking up the other half. So before, it would take a little bit of work to resize both windows, but now with Snap, it's really easy. Let's take an application here like Internet Explorer. If I want it to take up the left-hand side of the screen, I just click and drag on the, the title bar and take it to the left-hand side of the screen and it instantly fills up the left hand side of the screen. If I wanted, let's say, Explore to fill up the right hand side, I just click and drag on the title bar and drag it over to the right hand side of the screen. And now we can quickly view two windows at once. If we want to maximize a window, we can just double click on the title bar like we have in the past, or we can actually take it, click it, and drag it to the top of the screen, and that will instantly maximize it. Another great new feature is called Shake. And if you have a lot of windows open, and you want to minimize all of the windows except the one you're working on you just click and drag the title bar and just shake it and that will minimize all the other applications except the one you're working on if you want the applications to go back the, the way they were you just do it again so I'm gonna click hold my mouse button down and shake the window and all the applications go back the way they were